Yo, what is going on, YouTube fams? I'm your guy Rez, and I am back again with y'all on my channel for another video. Welcome back, guys and gals. So I have a streetwear haul that I want to share with y'all, specifically from the brand Stussy. So I actually went to the 626 Night Market out here in the Bay Area, California. This is the first one that I believe they're doing for the Bay Area of the year. And they're gonna be having another one in July, so I'm really stoked for that one as well. But if you guys have never been to the night market, basically it's a bunch of vendors that come all around from California and they basically sell you know, their food, they put their business out there. These are small businesses that are like mom and pop shops, so you're definitely gonna get something different from each vendor that's there and there's a lot of food options but they also do have a section where you can buy other uh, business uh, items as well and Stussy was actually one of the vendors that was attending the 626 night market in the bay area so Stussy is one of my favorite brands they're one of the oldest brands out there you know been around since the 80s and uh, Sean Stussy, shout outs to you. Your last name, man, has just made the world go round. <laughs> but uh, yeah, Stussy is one of my favorite brands. I love that brand. It's very simple. It's very dope. Very California-esque vibe for sure. They're all around the world. They have so many different flagships now um, from all across the globe. So um, I got some exclusive th stuff that I want to share with you all in this video that are Stussy exclusive. So I'm going to start off by sharing the hat that I got here. I got a couple of hats that I want to share with y'all, but here's the first hat, guys. And this one is really dope. As you can see, this is one of the older style. Um, I don't know exactly what season the pickups I got were from, but you know, these are really, really cool pieces from Stussy. And as you can see, there is a Stussy logo that's embroidered on there really really dope this is a new era cap as well seven and one half guys you could see you look at the back and just surrounding the entire hat you could see that nice little logo right there with that skull red underbill with a black sweatband you can see there the black new era tags the size seven and a half new era right there and then the Stussy hats tag which is really dope so this is my first pickup that i'm sharing in this video okay hat number two guys this one was really cool as well and this is like a camo version right here this one still has a tag on it as you can see there's a logo again on the back it does say classic camo there's no price on here you can see this beautiful nice camo design right here and then you can see there the skull size seven and a half as well if you look in the back of the hat you can see there's the crown stussy logo and the other logo as well underneath the hat again black sweatband seven and a half stussy hats all right the third and final hat that i'm sharing in this haul is still sealed in the bag it is a size smaller from the seven and a half this is the only size that they had for this style. I could do seven and three eighths as well, depending on the area of it. And I'm pretty sure this will fit me. But before I try it on for you guys, here is the really dope hat. This is also a new era fitted. And you have that simple LA embroidery right there in Los Angeles with the new era flag on the side. And again, you got the Stussy branding right there nothing on the back or on the sides a very simple hat guys get a nice gray underbill and this is some of the newer hats the authentic cap stussy the new era flag and the size see how it's different now seven and three eighths this is definitely a little more of the newer styled stussy hats and there's that tag right there so it does say new era cap this is made in Bangladesh and it says April 2023. So this hat is fairly new, guys. I remember they did a New York one as well. And I think they did like a Compton style hat. That one is really cool as well. But this one here is pretty dope. Actually goes with my fit. I'm not gonna lie. Tupac in LA, come on now. A really dope hat made by Stussy. And I got it for really cheap price as well. 
from the Stussy boot. All right, guys, and I have some other Stussy pickups that I'm gonna share with y'all. These are all t-shirts here. Um, I love wearing t-shirts. When it comes to streetwear, I'm very selective with like outwear jackets and other things as well. Um, I usually go for t-shirts because I love wearing tees. I mean, I'm always wearing t-shirts when I'm not wearing jerseys. I mean, everybody wears t-shirts, right? So I had to pick up some of these, but they're all great pieces in my opinion. They really cater to my closet and my wardrobe um, to represent you know, the brand Stussy. So I'm gonna start off with the first one, guys. This one is really cool. It's a very loud shirt, but it is a Stussy shirt in that vibrant green color. You look closely, it is screen printed with that nice skull again, and you have that big Stussy logo on the front right there. Here's a neck tag, double XL, made in Mexico with the washing instructions. Um, as far as Stussy shirts go, guys, they do run boxy, uh, depending on the era. I, I don't have too many Stussy tees. Uh, I, I mean, I have a fair amount, but I, I don't own enough Stussy merch to really break down sizes like you know not like with jerseys and stuff but yeah this shirt is definitely um a more boxier fit than like today's t-shirts when you see from streetwear okay and the next t-shirt is another green tee made by stussy once again this is a simple tee it does just have the stock logo image right there on the upper left chest with the stussy logo that is printed and if you look in the back it does have the logo again that's printed in bigger font of the Stussy logo, which is really cool. Simple T again, like I said. This is more of a pigment dyed process transfer on the shirt, which it does state on here. It does tell you that. Be very careful when washing these guys. You definitely don't wanna mix these with any whites because the color will potentially bleed onto your white fabrics. I mean, you don't wanna do that, right? You wanna wash it with light colors obviously guys and yeah this does fit a little more tighter around the neck collar from what i can gather because i think because of the transfer process it does make the fabric a little more stiff but as time goes on as you wash your garments this will begin to feel a lot more comfortable guys so yeah simple stock logo right there and that beautiful green i could wear a bunch of these tees in different colors guys just give me a whole rainbow palette with this stussy logo and your boy will gladly wear it all right guys and this tee right here it is pretty random from what i've been told from a lot of people but i'm a pretty random person man <laughs> just ask anyone that knows me personally but i love this tee man this right here guys is the birds of california tee made by stussy when i saw this t-shirt i was like kind of scratching my head trying to figure out okay what's the significance of it i mean obviously birds of california but what's the relationship with stussy in this um you know, I don't know, Stussy was founded in California, so maybe that's the significance, but I love birds. Uh, I always tell my wife this, that in another life, or when I retire, I'll probably be an avid bird watcher full time. <laughs> and um, yeah, this, this tee is just really cool, man. I really love animals and I love birds. And this is a lighter shade of green. This is definitely more like of a neon green. Size double XL, made in Honduras. And you have different types of birds, man. Like I said, both front and back of this shirt shares and shows off that. Look, I've seen a lot of these birds. I don't think I've seen all of them, but I've seen a good amount of these in the Bay out here in California. So really, really cool. Just has a list of birds and a nice little cartoonish look on these birds right here and really really cool man like i said i love birds and of course stussy one of my favorite brands you see the stussy logo right there this one right here i don't know if this is an exclusive chapter tee but it's definitely a tee that i will be wearing for sure and it is a white t-shirt with the stussy logo but it does say tokyo on the bottom i know stussy does have a location out there in Japan, so maybe this shirt was sold exclusively exclusively over there. I don't know for certain, but one of my things on my bucket list is to go to Japan and go to some of the shops out there that I'm a big fan of. Bape is one of them, Stussy is another. I definitely would love to go out there and check it out. But yeah, simple white tee, Stussy logo, washing instructions, no design on the back. All right, guys, and this final tee that I am going to share with you all in just a moment here is an actual 
exclusive from what I've seen. This is a chapter t-shirt right here and it is of the LA region guys. So this is the chapter T with the Stussy Los Angeles location as you can see right there on the upper chest portion of this shirt. This is just a plain white tee guys, but on the back you can see that Stussy logo again with the Los Angeles print. Really, really cool guys. I do have the Stussy Honolulu one when me and my wife went out to um, Oahu for our honeymoon, went to visit Stussy there as well. Also picked up a bunch of stuff and I did get a stock tee uh, with the chapter um, location there in Honolulu, which was really cool. So now I have the LA one. I would like to get as much of these as I can. I know they have a bunch of them. I saw like the Denmark one over there. I did see, uh, I believe a Hong Kong one that somebody picked up, which is really cool. And uh, they just had so much, man. Like, I wish I could have, I don't think I was able to film in there to be honest with you. I, I don't know. I don't want to be one of those guys, but they definitely had a huge selection. There was something for everyone there. You know, hats, outwear, um, chapter tees, exclusives, basic tees, shorts, everything, man. And it's a bunch of their stock, I'm sure, that they've just been sitting on or haven't been able to move, um, you know, that was there. So, yeah, I really, really recommend checking out the 626 Night Market if Stussy's a vendor. And just in general, if you guys go out there, there's just so much to do when you go out there in that night market, man. You could spend your entire day there. Uh, make sure you do wear sunblock, though, because it is hot depending on the time of uh, day and year that you go there, guys, you know. But, yeah, man. This LA exclusive chapter T by Stussy right here, man, is really, really cool to have. And um, yeah, man, still brand new with tag. So I definitely plan to uh, wear these tees in you know, my wardrobe and stuff. Again, like I said, I love Stussy, the brand, one of my favorite brands as well. But yeah, th that's my haul in this video today of my 626 night market pickups as well. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Before you go, if you like this video, give this video a thumbs up as well. Subscribe to my channel, smash that bell icon that way you don't miss any type of video that I post for y'all. And stay tuned, I have plenty of other videos that I have yet to show you guys and you know, I'm just excited man. This is brand new year, 2024. There's a lot of things to explore with you guys here on the channel. So on that note guys, I think I took up enough of your time thank you guys for watching this video as well thank you for always supporting me on the channel it means the world to me you guys have no idea so on that note thank you guys your boy rez we'll catch y'all on the next video i'm out peace